everybody. Welcome back to Ask Dallas, and I'd like to introduce the return of Mr. Colton Crumb, the phenomenal one. <laughs> so are you going to be interviewing me today, or? I think you know how this works. Okay, let's go ahead and get started then, Dallas. All right, first question here. If you had to get rid of soccer, sushi, or steak, what would it be and why? Sushi, because the reason being why, because I had a horrible experience with my with my uh, sister when she took me out for sushi, and I've had a sour taste in my mouth that for it ever since. Dallas, who did you want to win what WrestleMania thirty four? Main events. Yes. Well, I wanted Roman and Shinsuke to win, but Roman got the crap kicked out of him by Brock Lesnar himself. Mm. The part-timer who has no idea what he's doing. And, mm. AJ, and AJ and Shinsuke had a good match. A great match. But, I assume you just got a beep on your phone. I did. I did. It was telling you that the, the segment was over segment's not over. <laughs> uh, I'm kidding. I didn't. It's my ringer. AJ Styles retained over Shinsuke Nakamura, which kind of made me mad, but I. it was a great match. But Shinsuke ended up low-blowing uh, AJ Styles. You know what I want to see? What? Conor McGregor. Conor McGregor in there. Conor McGregor would not be a good instance. Ever Why since, not? Ever since the trash can incident. <laughs> You know, but I think that would be perfect for the WWE. You, you can't tell me that that wouldn't be awesome. You would honestly want a trash can thrown at you? I wouldn't, but maybe the WWE wrestlers, maybe Brock Lesnar wants that. He's too aggressive. Anyways, next, next question. Okay. Um, someone says, you should definitely play that I Rip My Pants song by Spongebob. Would you be for or against... Playing SpongeBob SquarePants in the in the cafeteria during lunch. I'd be for it, but it would depend on if it's the HD TV standards. Mm. If it's appropriate enough to play. Mm. I got a question for you. What? You think it'd be appropriate enough for Mr. Dale Snotty? Mr. Dale Snotty, I think he would enjoy it. Mm. I've ripped my pants. You know, Just kidding, folks. You should do a cover on that. I don't record any albums. We ought to get Tay Guapo to, to come in here. Let That's what in. I keep saying. I keep saying him to come in and do you know, like an original song or him and YRK do something. You know how awesome that would be? That Our would views be awesome. would skyrocket. What? Let, it, let, us know, let, let us know on the Snapchat, folks. You want to see Tay Guapo and YRK on Ask Dallas or on the announcements. All right, you ready for the next one? Yep. Okay, it's a video. Dallas, my class has a question for you. What's your favorite color? <laughs> What's your favorite color? And how do you feel about that picture? <laughs> yeah. Okay, what were the two questions because that happened so fast? <laughs> what was your favorite color? And what do you think of this picture? That's what I think of that picture, and what's my favorite color? It had to be blue. I'm pretty sure that's from 300. This is Sparta! You know, that honestly, like, I'm gonna probably going to get a lot of hate for this, but I really do love that movie. I think it's a great movie. Zack Snyder's a perfect, a perfect director. No, I really do. Like, I'm, like, every time I watch it, like, I, I'm so inspired. Like, not to, like, you know... Do you think bad? I could just get all excited about like nothing because <laughs> it's all like fiction. It chills down your spine, doesn't it? The the ending scene where he like bows down to the the king or whatever, and then he comes running out of the huddle and he jumps off his back and then he throws it and he like barely misses it. I don't know. I love That's it. That's a lot of armies. It really is. Okay, next question. Oh, now you're cutting me off. Yeah, now I'm cutting you off. We need to get on with the segment. Okay, we have another video. What was the first one? Who's your favorite YouTuber? Alex Luther. Okay. And he does fan-made trailers for, like, superhero movies. 
So Nike, Under Armour, or Adidas? Wear Nike shoes. What would you expect? Mm. You know what kind of shoes I'm wearing right now? No. New Balance. I don't know what those are. Honestly, you should give them a try. These are worn out shoes. You know it would be a good segment? What if we went and we got shoes with you? You know no. what I mean? No, my mom takes me shopping for shoes. Oh. Maybe we can, like, I don't know. I hang don't out. Know. Oh. Okay. I'm just, I don't know. Okay. Next question. It looks like from a guy you know very well. Hey, Dallas. Avengers or Justice League? Very good question. Uh, <laughs> I have to go with Justice League because I'm a big fan of Batman. Can you do a good Batman impression? I'm Batman. That's not bad. Question for you. This is just a me. This is a personal, like, something I want to know. If you could time travel, would you? Would depend on where to. You could time travel. I would time travel, but I, do, but I have to be very careful what I would change. What would you change about history or your life if you were to time travel? The birth of Colton Crumb. <laughs> and how would you change that, okay? I'm just messing with you. I, 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 <laughs> what, I'll tell you what you would do. You'd probably make, make my birth never happen, and then you would probably be student council president as like a freshman or sophomore. I don't even know if that's possible. Probably. Uh, I, 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 I will tell you guys the facts, though. According to physics or something like that, it's not possible to travel backwards in time. It's possible to travel forward, forwards in time. I do believe that. So I could go see Avengers Infinity War on April 27th. Check it out, folks. <laughs> well, uh, this has been an Ask Dallas segment. An Ask Dallas production. Thank you, and see you tomorrow.